the numbers are out and I'm here to deliver your first quarter real estate market update. And with most of the country being on lockdown, the results may surprise you. Hello, my friends, Katie Day with the Move Me to Texas team at Coldwell Banker. As your real estate partner, I'm here to keep you in the know as to the latest market trends, so let's dive right in. For Texas statewide, during the first quarter of 2020, 75,052 homes were sold, jumping 7% compared to the first quarter of 2019. Statewide, the median price increased 5.1% to $241,000. Price class distribution showed that the largest percentage of homes sold across the state at 33.8% were in the $200,000 to $299,000 price range. In the greater Houston area, closed sales are up 9.9% year over year, with 18,950 sales in Q1. Keep in mind those sales mostly, most likely went pending before the quarantine started, so I will continue to keep an eye on this category in the coming months. New listings, however, are down by 0.1% with 26,830 active listings. While many people are still listing their homes and buyers are still purchasing homes, many are holding off or they're putting a pause in their search as they navigate through COVID-19. The market does continue to hold strong when it comes to home prices with the average sales price up by 4.9% since last year. The median sales price in the greater Houston area is up to $243,900 in Q1. Days on market is at 66 days, up by two days from this time last year. This is most likely due to a decreased amount of listings or inventory as we have 3.5 months of inventory right now in Houston as compared to 3.7 in Q1 2019. So in some cases, it may take a buyer a little bit longer to find the right home. Low inventory produces a unique opportunity for sellers to list when they have very little competition. So if you're thinking of selling, there are still buyers who need to purchase for various reasons and inventory is necessary. And of course, stats vary by area and by price point. So if you or someone you know would like a detailed report for your specific situation, give me a shout. I will continue to keep you updated more in the coming weeks as we see how things unfold. Hope that you are safe and well, and I'll talk to you soon.